How's it going, guys? Today, or yesterday, um, England played Switzerland in a, in a Euro 2012 qualifier um, at Wembley, and uh, it finished 2-2. Two, two. Um, two goals from Barnetta for Switzerland and a goal for Frank Lampard on a penalty, and, um, and a goal from... Uh, Ashley Young. Um, uh, England <laughs> yesterday were flat out poor. They weren't too good yesterday. Played like garbage. And I don't know. We've been pretty good up in the qualifiers up till then. We had that game with Montenegro that was kind of awful. But until then, we were pretty good. We were beating beat Switzerland 3-1 already. Full, beat Bulgaria 4-0. But, um, yesterday they were pretty poor. Uh, Barnetta scored on the free kick in the 35th minute. It was awful defending. Um, nobody could clear the ball, and it ended up beating Joe Hart at the far post. It wasn't even a shot. It was just a chip into the box. It just happened to bounce all the way in. And the second one was bad defending, um... Uh, and uh, by Milner, and bad goalkeeping by Joe Hart. Um, that was three minutes later, and then uh, just afterward, uh, England were given a penalty because uh, Wilshire was brought down in the box by his uh, Arsenal teammate Dehuru. I believe his name is. I think that's how you say it, Dehuru. Um, and Frank Lampard converted the penalty. And uh, in the 49th minute, Ashley Young leveled the game. Now, a few talking points. Obviously, awful defending on these free kicks by England. And I'm not really going to talk about the penalty because it was a penalty. But if I'm going to talk about the penalty, I'm going to talk about Frank Lampard and... I don't know who th whose joke it was to have him take all the penalties, but he should not be taking them anymore. Um, he's frankly not too good at them, but I, he's still the one who takes them. I thought they'd give it to someone else at this point in time. Maybe start giving a couple to Wilshire. Um, a couple to... Uh, I guess you can give him a couple of wheels here. When Rooney's playing, he didn't play today, but when Rooney's playing, give him some to Rooney. Um, I think those two should be the new guys taking the penalty kicks, Rooney and uh, Wilshire. But um, Frank Lampard took it and he snuck it right under the goalkeeper. Goalkeeper guessed the right way, he just have, didn't happen to get it, snuck right under him. And then Ashley Young, uh, which was the man of the match for me. Uh, came on and scored in the 49th minute. Um, I don't. I didn't understand why Ashley Young didn't start the game to begin with. We didn't have any natural width out there. Um, if it were my way, which obviously it isn't, but uh, if it were my way, I'd be my team in general would look like Hart goalkeeper, um, Ashley Young at the back. Not Ashley Young, Ashley Cole at the back. We have Ferdinand, John Terry, and Glenn Johnson at the back. Uh, Rooney up front with Carroll. Um, and then the midfield, I'd have Gerard, Wilshire. Um, and then on the wings, I'd have Walcott and Ashley Young. And uh, I'd have those two on the wings because they bring pace and they bring creativity frankly. And uh, I know Gerard and Lampard are past their time, but um, are getting past their time at least, but I don't think, like, I think Lampard is flat out slow off the ball now. I think he's at least two steps back from everything that goes on now. Uh, I think he's just too slow for the game anymore. Or at least the internationally, I think internationally they should be given chances to someone else, maybe Jordan Henderson, possibly. But um, I don't think Lampard should even be called up anymore. And 
if Gerard's not, if Gerard becomes the same way after his injury, and I know he's only got a couple years left, but he comes the same way after their injury, then I don't think he should be playing anymore. I think Jordan Henderson should most certainly be in the squad after something like that. But um, Ashley Young, if you were watching the game, came on in the at halftime and he immediately changed the game. He was that much of a change for uh, what was going on. They were England were much better in the second half, but they still weren't living up to potential. Um, and Ashley Young helped with that. And I don't understand why Ashley Young wasn't starting to begin with, as I've mentioned before. But um. He wasn't, and uh, he came on, made the most of his time, scored the goal, and created a bunch of opportunities. We had plenty of opportunities the second half to uh, win the game, but uh, we didn't, and we came away with the point. And Montenegro came away with the point by drawing 1-1, which is, I guess, good for us in a way. But, um, but uh, it's all right. I think, I think England... Are okay for qualifying at least, but I think I think we need to get better, um, much better, and uh, I think we can be much better. And I think Capello has instilled this idea. I don't even an idea, but every time I see England play, they're playing with this fear about them that they're gonna lose each game, and you saw it in the World Cup. After the United States were uh, given that uh, goal, thank you, Robert Green, were given that goal, and from then on they played as if they're gonna lose all the time, and they were just sitting back hoping for draws. And with the players of the caliber we have, that should not be happening. They should be playing attack football, confident football, and we just haven't been playing that way. But um yeah guys, game comes over Switzerland, England draw two two and uh that's it. Peace.